Alright, what's up guys? In this video, I am going to show you how to jailbreak an iPhone 3G. Works also for the, for the iPod Touch 2G running 4.0.2. So, basically what we're going to do is, we're just going to go and download, which link is in the description, Red Snow 0.9.5B5-5. As you can see right there. So we're going to go ahead and browse for our current ISPW. You're not browsing for the current, you're browsing for 4.0. So the link is in the description. Make sure you download 4.0. So it's that one. Go ahead and open it. Processing your firmware. Successfully updated. Identified, I mean, sorry. Uh, go ahead and click next. Just repair your jailbreak kernel data. Patching the kernel, preparing the kernel. So you need to select what you want installed. So basically everything is checked. That's what you want. Uh, so now it says only click next once your device is both powered off and um, powered off and plugged in. So we're going to turn it off. Slide the power off. As you can see up there, it says no service. It's because it is. Um, Locked to Rogers, and I'm not with Rogers, I'm with Fido, so that's why it's no service because I had to use a Fido, a Rogers sim to activate it um, that I have. All right, so now we're just gonna go ahead and click next. So we're gonna have to hold the back. Okay, so this is just gonna walk you through a step to do DFU mode. So I'm gonna set this camera down and show you, show it to you. So let's set it down here. And I'm going to show you DFU mode right over here. So I'm going to go ahead and click Next. I'm going to read it to you what it says. So it says, hold the power button for three seconds. Without releasing the power, hold the Home button. As you can see, it shows the Apple signal. And t 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Like, release the power, but hold the Home button. So we got to hold the Home button. And we just got to hold it. For the next little while, shouldn't be too long. Okay, now it says Joe breaking, waiting for DFU, waiting for reboot. So now we can let go of it and just go back to looking at the computer screen. It says waiting for reboot. We got a white blank screen here that just turned off. Okay, let's go back out so you can see it. So I got bright sign lights. Now it says downloading Joe break data. So this shouldn't take too long. And we're just going to wait for that to be finished. Here is uploading RAM disk, and I think I was just covering the microphone. So it says downloading jailbreak data and uploading RAM disk. See, it's almost finished there. Uploading kernel, rebooting, it's done. So now the rest is going to take part on here. Shouldn't be too much longer. It never takes more than about 10 minutes to do the entire thing, depending. I mean, unless you have a really slow computer, that's the only reason why it's going to take a little bit longer. So we're just going to wait a bit. Alright, so now it's jailbreaking file system, replacing kernel. Flashing NOR, NOR, whatever you want to call it. This doesn't take too long, but after all, this is a 3G, so it is, the speed is not the fastest. And uh, Red Snow only works with the 3G. But anyways, this you can go ahead and close out any time. Basically, it's done for the computer-wise. Everything else is just taking place on the actual device. So you could just sit here with your uh, device and watch it, or just go ahead and fix yourself a copy and come back. Uh, it shouldn't take that long, though. So now it's rebooting after it's finished installing all the stuff. By the way, that pineapple thing is a jailbreak symbol that's been going around since a long time. Uh, if I'm correct, since uh, one. One, the first operating system, 1.0, whatever you want to call it. Although I've only been doing jailbreaks basically since 3.0. 
Um, I did have a jailbroken device on 2.0, but I, my friend did it for me because I had no idea. I learned all the jailbreak stuff on 3.0. <laughs> okay, rebooting sh should be done pretty soon, even though this part does take a little bit of time. Because it is the 3G, and the 3G does take a little while to boot up. If you have one, you'll know what I'm talking about. Unless you have an amazing 3G and it's always working, su it's always works super fast for you. There you go. So now it's, we're just gonna slide it. Come on. There we go. Slide. Scroll over, and we got Cydia. So now we're just going to open up Cydia and we're gonna install packages. All right, guys. This has been a jailbreak for. Um, the iPhone uh, 3G and the iPod Touch 2G. Uh, if this helped you, please subscribe and like this video. And we'll see you next time. Uh, just a little heads up. Uh, an un how to unlock your iPhone is coming up next. Peace.